When it comes to IELTS reading, knowing what to do is important. But do you know what's more important? Knowing what not to do. Hi, I'm Nivisha and today we will discuss five common IELTS reading mistakes that you must avoid to score a band 9. Let's begin. Mistake number one, not reading the instructions properly. It is actually as simple as it sounds, unless you really understand what's to be done in the question. Chances are you will make a mistake. So before attempting any question, make sure you read the instructions carefully. Certain reading tasks like sentence completion, identifying information, come with precise instructions regarding the number of words, answer format, etc. For instance, look at this matching information question. It says, write the correct letter A to J. So let's say the correct answer for the statement is A. But if you write France, it will be incorrect. If you write A France, it will still be incorrect. You have to just write the letter A to get it correct. So pay attention to such instructions. Mistake number two, exceeding the word limit. Some tasks like sentence completion come with a word limit. The question will say something like this. Use no more than three words and or a number. It's important to understand what this means. Your answer can be three words, two words, one word, three words and a number, two words and a number, one word and a number or just one number. Now this is again a matter of understanding. If you spend some time familiarizing yourself with such questions, you'll get them right. Do not leave these things for the test day. Figure it out during your prep time when you take practice tests. Our experts at Leap Scholar can help you practice a variety of sample questions and teach you tricks to find the focus points. Try the Leap Scholar free IELTS demo where you will learn from India's top IELTS educators. They'll resolve your queries and help you pick the right path ahead. Most of our students score a 7 plus band. Click on the link in the description to book a demo now for free. Mistake number three, using your knowledge to answer a question. Do not, I repeat, do not use your knowledge to deduce an answer in any of the task types. Use only the information provided in the passage. Don't get me wrong, you might be an expert on the topic, but information in the IELTS passages is often modified to suit the questions. So read carefully and make sure you get your answer from the passage itself. No external information should influence your choice. Moving on to mistake number four, not checking grammar and spelling errors. Make sure your answers are grammatically correct and do not have any spelling mistakes. Let's look at an example. The boy went to the park and plucked some flower. Now this is incorrect. It should be plural that is flowers. Similarly, be mindful about other grammatical mistakes like prepositions, articles, tenses and more. Apart from the grammar, whenever you write an answer, quickly take two seconds to check all the spellings. I know this sounds like a basic hygiene check, but many students lose marks because of this simple mistake. Mistake number five, spotting words in the passage. What this means is you read a statement or a question, you see a word and then you see the same word in the passage. Like this, you see the word piece rate in the options and in the passage. That was easy, you think. You found the answer, but that's not the correct answer. Don't make it a habit to spot answers this way. Read the passage properly to find the correct answer. Most of the time, words will be paraphrased. So if you take the technique, you will land with incorrect answers. Now, before we wrap up, I have one more bonus tip for you. So the bonus tip is do not leave questions unanswered. There is no negative marking in the reading section. So even if you don't know the answer to a question, try to guess it. If you get it correct, great. If not, you tried. You can learn many more tips and tricks to prepare well and ace the different IELTS sections. 
it's these baby steps that get you to a band score of 9. Try our free demo session. You will find it really helpful to understand where your preparation stands and how much help you require. Our IELTS experts will help you ace each and every section. They will teach you smart tips and tricks to ace the difficult questions. So click on the link in the description and book a demo for free. That's all for today. Hope you found this session helpful. Happy learning.